I have to say though, thank you for agreeing to talk to me. Um, I know you're from the streets and I know the streets is all about identity and not being seen. But I felt it was important that I talk to you because you're an older on the street and you know what's going on with the young people. And I think that people need to get that perspective. So they need to know what the olders think about the youngers. Because my generation, we think something completely different about young people. And you're closer to them than me, although you're slightly older. Um, and so you're, you're still on the street. I ain't on the street, fam. These youths are on the street for man. These youths yeah. are on the street moving the food for me, fam. I'm not on road, fam. I'm so the, I'm the, I'm the, I'm the man, that, I'm, I'm the, I'm the man they come to. I don't need to be on road. What do I need to be on road for, fam? So you get the, so you, you get the young people to of do. Of course, fam. All it takes is a bit of encouragement. You get me? No, no, you wants no seven pound twenty hour a job, fam. You get me? When I showed him this, you get me? Like, that's all it takes, fam. How long does it take to make that kind a of? Couple money? days, my G. Couple days. A man them are slaving away for a fucking paycheck when they can get this in a couple of days, fam. Think about it, lad. Yeah, but so, but, but, but the young people see money, yeah, uh, and they, and and I guess you guys kind of glamorize that money. Of course we glam in, we glamorize it because we get it. Man gets dough out of here. You get me? So where do the young people fit into all of this? They just eat. They're easy targets, fam. You get me? They're easy targets. They don't want to be on. They don't want to be working no job, fam. In debt from uni and then fuckery, man. Just encourage them. There's easy pee to be made out here. Push, push, push some packs. You get me? Push some food for man. And man will get that dough. Simple. It's not rocket science, my G. So the young people coming up now have got to look out for people like you. Not necessarily, because I look out for them. I. I target them. If I see a man is, if I see a man is an e easy target. Man is targeting him because I know he's going to get this pee for me. And I know that he wants pee. But what's the easy target? You understand? Are you talking about any child? Fam, and, no, and... no, no. You got to look at, you got to look at the M's. You got to look at what youths are growing up in single parent households. You got to look at what man's environment is. You get me? What man's parents are doing. Is man's parents a crackhead? Is man's parents on food? You get me? They're the easiest targets there because they're tainted. You get me? They got no other option. You get me? Yeah, yeah. So they're no, the easiest ones to target, what you're saying. I'm hearing what you're saying. So you're like, saying like you're making vulnerable. No, nah, you're making it like the way you're making it sound. Yeah. It's like it's a hard thing, fam. This ain't hard, you know. Any one of these youths passing, man, can approach them, fam. Yeah, but what if they? Right. So you're saying that you could approach any youth, what school age? School age specifically, my G. Specifically. Like Specific. them early, them early teen ages is the best way to the best age to catch them, fam. <laughs> man ain't going to school. You thought you think you think you think man's putting on his uniform in the morning and saying, "Yeah, but I'm going to school." Nah, fam. He's coming to me and he's putting his tracksuit on and he's pedaling on the road, fam. You get me? Then he's going home after school. He's saying, "Yeah, mom, I had a good day at school." You get me? So or on the flip side, now nah, you got the mums that want to question man for not working. Go on, go on. So on the flip side now, you got the you got the mums questioning their youths why they're not working. Where's my rent? Where's this? Where's that? If he's just dashing a little, a little five bills on the table, you think she's asking questions? You think she's gonna say, "Oh, where'd you get that money from?" She don't care. She's got her five bills. She's nice. Get me? This is the re this is the reality of the road, fam. So the reality of the road is that some of the parents know their children. Of course they. D come on, come on. Well, you think all these youths on the road, you think their parents don't, you think some of their parents don't know. They know what they're doing. They know the consequences. You get me? But if they... It, but what about you? What, you've been on the road so long. What about you and your family? Do you have any what children? What about me and my you... family? I've got youths. Man, look after my youths. Nice, because I get this pee, fam. So what happens if, if somebody tried to use your child? <laughs> that ain't gonna, that will never happen, fam. Never. You see this? Trust me, fam. It's not gonna happen. No knives involved. This is gonna happen. You get me? That's what's gonna happen. But you think this? Wow. You think this is all? You think this is la la land, fam? You think this is all playthings? Yeah. This is real shit, you know. I hear, I'm hearing what you're saying. Any, anyone trying to approach my you? Yeah. Nah, fam. Never, never. They're not even at that age yet, but still, they're never gonna get trapped because man's gonna make enough pee to get them out of this shit, fam. To get them out of this environment. You get me?
So what about you though? You you just kind of intend to do this for as long fam, as. What possible. the fuck is wrong with what I'm doing, fam? Because you're 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 involving. No, but tell me what. No, but tell me what I'm doing is wrong. Tell me what what am I doing that's wrong, fam? What you're doing is what what you're doing is you're entrapping young people. That's to do point. your work. Yeah. What? Because man don't want to go jail, fam. What you think? Man want to sit in a bin. If what? man can get if man can get five youngers to peddle food for man and I avoid jail, fam. What? Where's the? That's a win-win, blood. It's a win-win. They come to me. You get me? They drop the pee. They get more food and they go about their business. Well, like, what? There's no risk. The only risk is any, if anyone's going to snitch. But fam, I showed you what I've got in my pocket. You get me? That's the consequences. Uh, is, you fam. know, you, you know. I know this thing is happening. It upsets me when I talk to you about it, face because it makes it more real. But you know, our young young people are dying on the streets now. That you know, That's what I mean, the they're way dying is, on the streets. There's, there's young people dying everywhere, fam. Look how many people are getting shanked every day, shot every day, fam. What, what would what, you say about that? What do I say about that? That's the way the road is. <laughs> what? Like, what? If man, if man's going to rob my one of my youths, I'm going to tell him, fam, you go and get your pee back, man. You go and get your drugs back. You get me? Do, what if, do whatever you have to do. If they need help with that, obviously man's going to provide, fam. Simple. Jeez. Wow. Fam, you laugh, blood. This ain't no wow, joke, I'm you know. I'm not laughing at no I, joke, I, fam. I'm not laughing at disrespect. I'm laughing because I'm shocked that it kind of it works that way so we're we're, we're looking at these young people thinking they're getting into trouble where all the time there is Fam, I'm uh, i don't want to say it like this but there are people like you out there and i've known you for for a long time there are people like you out there that are basically recruiting them fam listen yeah these youths ain't got dads fam they look at they look up to me fam i'm a i'm a rock if you want if you want to put it like that i'm a role model to these youths fam Get me? Who else are they going home to, fam? What other male figures have they got to help them, fam? You tell me, innit? So, so, if, if we're looking to change anything on the streets, if we're looking to change anything for these young people, you're saying that this is the way it is, this is how it goes? I'm not saying that, fam. I'm saying to you that these youths are easy targets and they can get easy pee if they want to live that life, fam. Man ain't gonna force no you to do what he don't wanna do, innit? But man, man's never, ever had a you tell me no when I introduce him this life. Never had a you say no to me, fam. Because he wants that P. You get me? When he sees on the yeah. first day he's making a grand, fam. What? So it's all about the money. So, they, so, so, so all, everything that's happening on the streets is all about making easy money. Easy money, fam. It's as simple as that, fam. And if the young people don't want to... All right, I'm going to give you a scenario. If a, if a young person owes you some money, what, what then? Because they're right. young, they don't know what they've they got themselves into. They best get that into. P, fam. This is what I'm saying to you. I let them know the consequences, fam. Like, I'm not letting them go into this blind. If you're working for me and you fuck up, you lose P, you get robbed, you best get that back. Best get that back. Simple. You best get that back or... Whew, let me simple as that fam you don't go into any any business and not know that there's there's risks to it you get me there's consequences and at the end of the day there's risks anyway fam so, so i spend my time telling young people that there's another way they ain't fucking listening to you fam they ain't listening to you fam You can try and inspire these youths it. all you want. There you have it. You can try and you can try and talk to them. You can try and do your little YouTube videos, fam. They ain't fucking listening, blood. They want that money, innit? They want that P, fam. And there's no way this is gonna change. No, I ain't what? I ain't changing. I'm gonna keep. You think I'm the only one who does this, fam? You think it's just me? <laughs> You're mad. I thought you knew better, fam. Hmm. Wow. You must think it's just me out here, blood. There's a gang of, there's a team of us, you know? There's a team of us, fam. And it's easy, it's easy. I have to say that I'm, I'm, I'm a little bit disturbed at this, this interview. Be disturbed, bro, you can be disturbed all you want. This is the facts of life, yeah, I'm, a little, I'm a little bit disturbed at this. South London, it, it East London, real... North London, fam. This is all happening, fam. It don't matter what part of London. It don't even have to be London, fam. This is the way it is. With the young people. Get me, no. There ain't no such thing as a legitimate grand, fam. 
No one's making no pee off no legitimate, le legitimate life, especially from where we're from. I'm gonna have to shut this interview off because it's kind of distressing me a little bit, um, as the truth does. And, you know, I just hope you get something from it because my man's saying that, you know, things ain't gonna change on the streets, but I, I firmly believe it's all gonna change. You can go, you can go past. Um, I, firmly, I firmly believe things are gonna change on the road and that's why I work you so can hard think, you can think with what these you young like. people. You can think what you like. You can have as much positive energy as you want about this thing, fam. The reality is, this is happening and it ain't changing. You get me? Shut, shut this off, shut this off, shut this off.